Sometimes in our darkest moments, talking with peers who have been there can be a lifeline. Capital Respite is a Lansing-based business offering peer services to the community free of charge. Francis and Rob from Capital Respite are joining us today to talk about the incredible program. Thank you so much for joining us today. Yeah, thanks for having us. Yeah, thanks for having us. So let's start from the beginning. Why did you start this incredible program? So like um, all of the other reasons we do this work, we are people who have lived experience with um, utilizing mental health services and substance use services. And this came from an instance where I needed help with something and I wasn't finding what I needed. And we knew that respite a peer respite is something that's available in other states and in a couple cities in Michigan, but we didn't have one here. And so we decided we want to start one. Yeah, if you can't find it, you make it. I love that. Yeah. yeah. So for those who might not really understand or haven't been in a place where they needed peer support, why is peer support so helpful and important? Stigma is uh, a big component of mental health. Uh, a lot of times people don't understand or can't, uh, don't know how to specifically help just your average person. Um, and sometimes with mental health professionals, uh, having somebody who has been there and has been through it knows how to navigate the system themselves and knows the shortfalls of some of those different programs uh, can help somebody who, when you're in the middle of a crisis, it's hard to advocate for yourself. You said this is something that we haven't had. Why is this something we need? Are you seeing that we need this? I know from your own experiences we do need this, but why is this unique to our community? So it's unique to our community because right now for individuals who are in mental health crisis, they only have a couple options. They either have um, inpatient hospitalization or um, what's called partial hospitalization. It's basically outpatient. And um, what we're looking to offer is a residential service that's peer delivered. So this is um, where someone can go and they can spend one to five days um, and it's either going to be free of charge or it'll be very low cost for some. People want to have options. They want to have more than just go into a hospital where I might not know if I can leave when I want to or the partial hospitalization where they don't know if they're going to get that inpatient secure type feeling. And so having this very comfortable home-like environment where people can go and feel supported by other people in recovery, it's unique and it's needed in this area. Yeah, and I, I have to imagine that having to go to somewhere where you might not know if you can leave can make a scary situation already much scarier. So having that peer support is so important. How can the community support you as you start this new journey? Uh, currently, we are fundraising for our 501c3 status. Um, we are planning on offering a QPR training. That's a, a way that the average person can help somebody who is experiencing a crisis while maintaining their autonomy. Yeah. So it's, it's less about, uh, it's less about ca catching somebody who's having a hard time and more about listening to somebody who's having a hard time and then helping them access the services that they want. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So something that I think we'd like the community to know is that this is a very new and unique service to our area and that we know it's going to take some time for people to adjust to the idea that um, people in crisis can be supported by other people in recovery and not necessarily what you would expect. Anyone can support people in recovery and um, peer services are a very valid way for people to receive crisis services and we're really hoping to educate the community on that and just raise awareness all together that autonomy and having multiple options are critical for people to get into recovery and stay in recovery. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you so much for the work you're both doing and thank you so much for joining us today. Um, I'm excited to see where this goes. Yeah, thanks for having us. Thank you. Absolutely. Mm -hmm.